Hey everybody, my name is Ang Zichi and you can call me Ben and today I'll be teaching you guys how to edit a certain type of meme music video that has been circling around for the past few weeks on social media and uh, it's this type of video you can see it right here yes i purposely filmed myself for this tutorial if you want to watch that video full which is only like 15 seconds uh you have to download tiktok and watch it yes your boy has tiktok but only that video so without further ado let's jump into after effects first of all you have to download a snippet of the song you may get a snippet of the song on tiktok all you have to do is record the duration of how long you think you'll be dancing. Record a blank clip of that 15-30 seconds of where you want to dance and then you have to upload it privately so that no one sees that blank slate and then download the file from your phone and then hook it up to your PC or from your phone just split the mp4 clip into an mp3 clip so that you could play it on loop with your music player app. So after you have recorded your dance video, drop the clip and the song into your After Effects, create your composition with the correct parameters. And since it is a vertical video, it should be 9 by 16. Then you trim your clip to the correct in and out points. Mark your specific keyframes of where you want the flying object to merge with your body part that you are rotoscoping off. And then duplicate your original clip as many times as you see fit. And now it's time to rotoscope. Select your pen tool and begin tracing along the parts of the body that you are going to rotoscope out. Please make sure you're selecting the correct layer to rotoscope on. You may use a mouse or a Wacom tablet during this step, whichever you see fit, and whichever that is more comfortable for you. After you've completed your rotoscope, go to your transform properties and look for position. Click on the stopwatch to set a keyframe, and then go back a few frames however much you see fit, and then drag that body part out of frame to whichever direction you want it to come in from. Oh, and also, remember to freeze that frame so that your body part stays on that frame. And that's pretty much it. Just repeat the step a few times and you'll end up with a final video like this. Now that you have your own personalized dance video, share it with your friends. Let them have a good laugh at it. And I hope you guys enjoyed today's tutorial. If you like this video, don't forget to slam the like button and remember to subscribe. Please do check out the other videos as well. And I'll see you tomorrow.